Uh, greetings everyone. Uh, in this video, we'll be looking at uh, NC Level 3 Mathematics Achievement Standard uh, solving uh, systems of uh, simultaneous equations. Uh, so in this video, I will show you how we can use um, a graphics calculator to solve uh, systems of linear equations. So we'll have a look at the example. Uh, this is the example that I did in my previous video uh, where we uh, solved it uh, algebraically. So uh, if you haven't watched that, uh, please do watch that uh, video. So the first thing you need to um, make sure is that the uh, equations are given uh, in this form ax plus by plus c is equal to uh, d. So that means after the equal sign you should have a constant and we have variables on the uh, left hand side of the equal sign because the graphics calculator is programmed uh, in this form so we have to uh, have it in that form. So on your graphics calculator you click menu and then uh, you uh, go to equations, hit enter. And uh, once you get there, you will need to um, select um, uh, simultaneous. And the way we can do that is by pressing F1, so F1. And then here we are solving uh, systems of linear equations with three unknowns. So uh, three unknowns means I will click F2. And this gives you uh, the uh, matrices that we uh, can fill in. So the, um, the general equation, as you can see, is written in that form ANX plus BNY plus CNZ is equal to a constant DN. That's why we need to uh, make sure that our equation is written in this form. Uh, all the variables are on the left hand side. And then after the equal sign, there's a constant there. So now we'll uh, enter the um, equations. So what we need uh, is the uh, coefficients of uh, x, y, and z. So we will. that's what we will uh, need. So uh, the first equation was 2x plus y plus z is equal to 3. So uh, 2, enter, and then uh, it was y. So y is 1y, enter, and z is 1z, so 1, enter, and then uh, that was equal to 3. So that's the first equation. Likewise, we'll enter the second one. x minus y plus 3z is equal to uh, 20. So 1x. So 1, enter negative 1, because it was negative y, plus 3z. So 3, enter, and then uh, 20. And then the third equation, we had 4x plus 2y plus z is uh, one so four plus two y so coefficient is two and z is one z and then that's equal to one now once i've entered all of the uh, values then you just hit solve and it will give you the uh, values for each of the uh, variables there so in this case x is one y is uh, uh, negative 4 and uh, z is 5. Pretty basic as you can see. Now the calculator will uh, solve if the uh, if there is a unique solution. In my previous video I've gone through uh, uh, three different cases. One was unique solution, so in this case we had a unique solution, a uh, common intersection. But uh, in other cases uh, where you uh, have uh, inconsistent equations or dependent, then in that case, uh, the calculator will give you math error, and that should indicate that um, you have got uh, uh, either of the other two arrangements which you need to investigate further for merits and excellences. So if you've got a graphics calculator, you can uh, use that in the assessment, but what you need to do is uh, you need to communicate your final answer and indicate what each of these variables represent. So here's a quick summary uh, how to use uh, the graphics calculator. So, so you select the equation mode, then you hit F1 to get the simultaneous. Once you've got the simultaneous, pick uh, three unknowns, and then uh, you so you enter the matrix from the um, equation that's given. Remember, you just need the coefficient of uh, each of the variables and the constant value as shown here, and then uh, you uh, solve. And then that gives you the solution 1, negative 4, and 5. I uh, hope this is uh, helpful. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.